hello friends welcome back to my youtube channel today i'll explain you about the violin do while loop in ua path okay quickly i'll open the ua path now so i already made a sequence with the uh, switch case uh, statement initially i will verify what is the switch case uh, statement how it works and also you can refer to my previous video how the switch case statement works and uh, on this switch case statement only you will apply the uh, the while and uh, do while loops I'll quickly run this switch case statement how it works later we will show you how I applied the while and do while loop I'm I'm running this one so M here so what exactly here is the switch case statement here so enter an alphabet M A R D so whenever whenever I'm entering this alphabet as M it will go to the case M and similarly when I enter the alphabet as A it will go to the case A addition okay whenever they enter the alphabet as d it will go to the case d so for this one i have to enter alphabet three times so i have to run the execution three times if you want to check all the cases so quickly i'll verify it now so i'm i'm executing it for a now okay addition of two and four is six if you want to verify the case for d and to re-execute the script so i'm re-executing this one D. So instead of uh, executing multiple times to verify the case statement, I can I can use this while in do while loop also. So quickly I will go to the do while loop. What happens here? In the do while loop, the name itself says that first do the do the action, and after that you check the condition. In the do while loop, what happens is the first is the body. First it verifies the first it executes the condition, and after that it verifies the condition is met or not. But in the in the while loop, first it verifies the condition. If the condition satisfies, then only it will goes for the action to execute or not. I hope you understood what is the difference between while and do while loop. So here, for the same uh, switch case statement, I will uh, execute quickly. So I am entering a number here. I am verifying the uh, i less than or equal to number. If that is the case, I execute the switch case statement. Okay. So, I am quickly running this uh, while condition. So, I am giving the value as uh, 3, means that I want to verify for the 3 variables, okay. That is M, A, and D. So, if M, so again it will ask for the A, okay. After that, because the variable I is starting from 1, I will keep as 0 so that it will ask for me 3 times. Okay, I'll quickly run this while while loop again. So I believe I have entered the invalid value. So I'll enter this. Okay. See, it's executed three times. So what exactly happened in this one is first I have taken the input dialog box for the uh, variable. So I have uh, given this output variable as a result that is a number and that number I have given as 3 in the previous example. So i is less than or equal to number initially here it is 3 as i is starting as i is starting from 0. So as 0 is less than i as 0 is less than 3 it will go and verify the action. So inside the sequence, um, I have reused the same sequence as switch case statement. Please refer to my previous video how the switch case statement works. And here I am incrementing the i after the completion of my job. i is equal to i plus 1. So it will keep on increasing my uh, i value. So as it reaches the value of uh, uh, number 3, i is equal to i is equal to 3 as 3 is less than or equal to. So it will stop. Okay. So as i is equal to i is starting from 0, 0, 1 and 2 and after the moment it increases the value as 3, it will it will come and check here 3 less than or equal to 3 that is incorrect. So it will it will exit out of the loop. Okay, and similarly if you go to the do while loop, so what it happens it will execute the action after that it will verify the condition. So here it may my action is same as same only the switch case statement. It will verify the switch case statement. I am increasing the i value 
and that is incrementing the value and after that it will go and verify the uh, condition so i'll quickly verify so i is starting from i'll put as i is starting from zero okay so i'll execute this uh, do while loop quickly so i'm giving the value as uh, three so i can verify okay it will exit because it has already reached the value i is less than or equal less than number so what exactly the difference between do while and while so in the do while first it executes the action later it will verify the condition for example i am starting i is equal to 1 financial variable i is equal to 1 i am starting okay and even the even in the uh, while loop also will make psi starting variable is 1 ok so I will quickly save this one I will explain you what is exactly the difference between do while and while now if I give the value as 0 for the input dialog box first what should happen without checking the condition for me it should execute the action ok after that only it should verify the condition but in the in the while loop in the while loop first should verify the condition then only it will verify it executes my condition okay so i'll quickly verify this uh, do while loop do while loop now so in the do while loop i will give as zero okay so first it executes the action to me okay later only it will verify my condition okay as my condition is not satisfying it exited because zero because i number i given as zero but i is less than okay i is equal to 1 1 less than 0 that is incorrect so it's exited the condition but if you go to the while con while loop what should happen is it will verify the condition first okay i'll give the 0 here okay so it will exit quickly because the first itself the condition has verified it didn't it didn't go inside the action so inside the body it exited directly so when you when you should use this while and uh, do while loop so whenever in your ex, in your uh, uh, in your execution flow wherever you want to execute the first uh, condition later only if you want to verify the uh, condition then you can go for the do while but but wherever you want to verify the condition first then only it, will, it should execute my flow then you should go for the while loop i hope you understood the differences between while and uh, do while loop Okay, so please subscribe to my channel if you want to visit similar kind of videos in UiPath. Thank you. Thanks for watching.